What's going on everyone? Hope everybody had a good holiday and happy new year. Today I'm gonna do a mukbang and test out my new hot pot slash Korean barbecue grill. It's like a two in one combo that I got for Christmas. And I'm gonna have um, the official drink of 2021. Twisted Tea, it's my first time having it, so. Cheers, let's get right to it. <clears throat> so this is my dinner. It's uh, I'm doing a both hot pot and Korean barbecue. Um, I got the basics. I got a uh, fat beef. Throw, throw some in here. You know, some fatty beef. Uh, I got some shrimp. Some shrimp. Also, I'm missing something. Uh, yeah, I'll lay it out. It's a. Uh, I'm missing the bok choy. I got some bok choy and lettuce. It's in the fridge. So let me just get that out real quick. Put out some pork belly for the K barbecue. Some samgapsai. I think that's how you say it. <laughs> uh, just. So this grill, um, my girl's mom got it for me. I had something I wanted, but I, I didn't ask for it. So I'm pretty surprised they got it for me and um so far it is pretty good like I just turned it on it's already boiling I put it in like a medium high because um the high setting is super hot the thing was bubbling and it was really steamy so I went ahead and uh lowered it just for the sake of the video <clears throat> hope everyone's doing well um 2020 was a crazy year for all of us but um hopefully this year will get better you know and um I'm just trying to do more. Whatever I did last year as far as content goes, I'm trying to double up this year, whether it be mukbangs, music, comedy, <clears throat> all that good stuff. So, the only way to grow. Let me just uh, get my life together real quick. Got my lettuce. Um, got some enoki mushrooms. I'm just gonna go ahead and dump these mushrooms in here. The enoki mushrooms, one of my favorites for hot pot. Let's go ahead and dump this whole little package in here. Oh yeah, the soup base I'm using is uh, it's a Tom Yum pre-made soup base. Just you know for you know, it's like instant. You know you ain't gotta like make it from scratch. You know I felt like just go ahead and make a quick dinner. But if yeah, it's in the Asian market. It's a Tom Yum soup base. Um, it's pretty good. I can show you the yeah it's right here. It's the Thai Tom Yum soup base uh, by Bullhead. I got it at J Mart at my local grocery store. And um, let's see what it's talking about. It is, yeah, so the grill burns really hot, really fast, so that's good. And um, I put the link to the grill combo slash hot pot combo um in my YouTube description for those interested. And getting one for yourself, uh, I'll put in an affiliate link so you know I get a small commission. You know, so all right, bok choy. I gotta love bok choy. Gotta eat your greens, y'all. Make sure y'all eat your greens. I love me some bok choy. Uh oh, Sarah here. Uh oh, Sarah's, Sarah's here. She's Trying to, just trying to get some of this. All right. Got my, I got a little bit of rice. I'm not gonna eat too much rice because I'm trying to eat all these greens, mushroom. Put all this shrimp in here. Go ahead and just let the hot pot do its thing. So far, so good. Part belly. I'll flip it. Do that sizzle. Uh oh, Sarah about to knock down my, my whole setup. Sarah, go outside. <clears throat> oh yeah, sauce, I got like this little uh, dipping sauce from the, the market. I'm not sure what kind of sauce it was, but it just said like Sichuan uh, spicy sauce. So pretty good. Go ahead and just eat. Good spoon, man. Are you trying to eat rice with a chopstick? Yo, if you guys eat rice with your chopstick, 
leave me a comment because I think that's hard for me. Like, that's uh, that's too much work. I just go ahead and just, you know what I mean? Probably eat a, only one cup of rice today. Yeah, so this is my first time ever making a little hot pot for myself, like a personal hot pot. I plan on uh, doing this for my fam this weekend, though. It's a cool little combo, you know? It'll probably serve like three or four people. It's not too big. I've seen some cool ones online where there's like a longer version with a built-in uh, pot and a, the, the grill. It's pretty cool. But I like this because it's like space saving. I might, I might be using this every day now. <laughs> I'm just eat right out the pot because I'm the only one eating it. But you know, it's not double dipping if you're the only one eating, right? It's not some old croak. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wash it down with some twisted tea. Ah, pretty good. Put some more. Put some more of this pork belly. I don't even know the story about my hot pot adventures like that. I don't even know how I started eating hot pot. Like, I don't know who put me on back in the day. I think it was a late, a late bloomer to like Korean style barbecue or uh, Mongolian, Korean or uh, even Mongolian style barbecue. I think it was probably someone, one of the homies took me there to a spot when I was in, at, shortly after college. So, and I immediately, I loved it. Anything with the broth, Anything that cooks instantly, I'm on that type of time. Mm hmm. I think the. Let me turn back the. The pot. Yeah, so this Tom Yum base. It's pretty much like um, small but you and it's, it's really good. It's either that or like the plain broth. I'm like, ah, I'm not too into the plain broth. I like flavor, you know, I like that choo choo. Let me know how you guys like your um, hot pot. Maybe some of these mushrooms. Alright. So I haven't really been like going out. You know, I've been socially distancing myself and just uh learning how to cook on YouTube and just um cooking for myself. So far I learned how to make salami grill. I know how to make grill from scratch now, so I'm proud of myself. You know? Follow directions, you know, follow the recipe. It's not that hard. You know? You can't eat, you know, rice with soy sauce forever, right? At some point, you gotta, you gotta level up in life and just eat what you crave, eat what you love. Whatever your favorite meals are, you can make it. There's lots of good recipes on, on YouTube, too. A lot of my recipes, if you're into that. Everything. I spend most of my time on YouTube. Look at that tutorial. <laughs> Is there a specific channel that um, you guys like to watch for recipes? Uh, leave me a comment and I'll check it out. Mm hmm. Shit, delicious. Oh, Sarah's over here pacing back and forth. 
So I probably gotta walk her right after I eat. That's pretty much my life. I walk my dog. Sarah gets her walk like three times a day. Three times a day and you know. That's why I haven't been really vlogging. It'll be it'll be the same thing over and over. You know, unless you guys wanna watch me uh walk her every day, but <laughs> I give her some 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 time. I give her some love in my my IG stories a lot though. That's my that's my dog. That's like my best friend. I don't know what I do without the Sarah Bear. She's like attached to my hip. It's getting hot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mainly just wanted to do this video and test out the grill. So far, it's legit. I like it a lot. Looks like it's easy to clean too. Plug it right in, turn the knob, and instantly, instantly cooks. So, I'll leave a link in the description. Y'all can check it out. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Also, I got, I got some new merch. You know, this shirt I'm wearing, which says, Tomorrow's Not Promise. Act a fool today. I'll leave a link for this shirt, too. Also, got some Chili Talk merch for those that have been following my podcast. I'm excited to uh, for, for this year. I got a lot of cool guests lined up for this year. Also, I want to thank all the guests that, um, that were a part of my, uh, I guess you could call it the first season. I started in August and had a lot of great guests. You know, shout out to all you guys for um, being a part of it. And thanks to everybody that's been tuning in for the support. Also, leave me a comment of who, who you guys want me to interview for future episodes. I'm always looking to highlight small businesses or interview anybody in, you know, anybody that's doing something in the game. Positive things in life. Let me take turn this down a notch. Now it's really hot now. I think it's on the highest setting. Let me just start eating some lettuce. That way, um, put some more meat in here. I put some meat on the. Yeah, this fatty meat. It's like it gets cooked so fast, so. Use my hands, don't mind me. I wash my hands, so boom, boom. And pretty much, yeah, I've just been working from home, grinding. I'm also just started uh, trading stocks, so that's an, something new that I've never, uh, you know. And I never, I've just something new that I've been learning, you know what I mean? And it's pretty cool. I've been hanging in there, doing my research, my due diligence, you know? A little bit of day trading. <laughs> so far I'm up, I'm not, I'm not down, so that's a good thing. Oh yeah, so if, you, if you trade stocks for a living, I would love to pick your brain. Leave me a comment. Maybe I'll get you on a podcast. <laughs> Mm hmm. Mmm. It's really dope. As you can see, it's, it stays piping hot. A hot pot stays hot. The, the meat gets cooked right away. So good. It's like going to a restaurant for a fraction of the price. Mm hmm. Let me get some of these mushrooms. You know what I forgot though? I forgot some, to get some meatballs. I like the ones with the, the fish roe in it, you know, the eggs. It's really good. But this is a nice little meal though. This is my dinner. Probably have it for uh, lunch tomorrow or breakfast or something. Still have uh, about, quite a few meats. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right.
right, so I'm pretty much done. I'm, I'm gonna finish up and eat, but I just wanted to you know test out the grill, show you guys what I, what I got for Christmas and um what I'm gonna be using a lot. So you might see me do some more of these mukbangs, and um you know if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so. It helps a lot. Also, if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, I also do all, a lot of other things like comedy, music, all kinds of things and vlogs. So, you know, I hope I hope you guys come back and um, it's going to be a good year. Hope everyone stays safe. I'm sending positive vibes and uh, wishing everybody good health and prosperity for the new year. Peace.